Pop What Up XRP community. Welcome. Today we have some very interesting things to talk about. XRP has been booming today and I think it's up like 14 or 15 percent. And let's let's make a quick breakdown and see what it means. Like can it go higher or or what's going on? So let's uh, dig in. Hearing in SEC case positive for Ripple XRP says lawyer. So we already know this. I covered this in my previous video, but uh, I still wanted to just like uh, break it down what the judge exactly said and what's going on. So here we have something interesting. No matter what the SEC may try and argue, a currency and a security are by definition in opposite. These are two different things, Hogan said. He added the judge offering the view that XRP has utility is exactly what Ripple wants the court to be thinking. And here we have the second bombshell, said Hogan, came as Nedburn questioned whether everyone who sold XRP, including you and me, are selling illegal securities. Based on the SEC's prior argument, the SEC attorney responded by saying that under Section 4 of the Securities Act, only Ripple and its affiliates, meaning employees, Hogan said, could be accused of illegal sales. So that means that every exchange, guys, can just list, uh, list XRP again because they don't have to fear that they're doing something illegal, which is why XRP is very much up to date. Now, there is a BIS summit coming up. Uh, it's already ongoing. And I want you to take a look at this, actually. This is a very interesting video. Here we have the Deutsche Bank. And look what he's talking about. Businesses, banks, and other private actors are pressing ahead with innovative digital solutions that serve the needs of consumers. In the financial sector, central banks can play an active role in shaping the digital transformation by enhancing their payments infrastructures, by facilitating supervision in real time, or by strengthening cybersecurity. In the same vein, we are currently exploring the benefits and risks of a digital central bank currency within the euro system. Digital innovation is not an end in itself. It allows central banks to fulfill their tasks more effectively and efficiently. That's why central banks need to be open-minded and ready to collaborate. In the euro system, we know how to achieve a common purpose. The BIS Innovation Hub Centers represent an excellent network for mutual learning and developing new solutions, solutions that will improve the resilience and performance of tomorrow's financial system for the benefit of the people of Europe and around the world. Now, isn't that interesting, guys? They are exploring a digital central bank currency, which is exactly what Ripple is waiting for because they want to bridge all the currencies, remember? So this is the BIS Innovation Summit. You can access the virtual event. It's not ongoing now. Here's the agenda. I will put the link in the description and you can participate and see what's going on. Very interesting, guys. Here we have the pitch that Ripple is using for the, for the summit. So this is very interesting. The CBDC private ledger is based on the same blockchain technology that powers the XRP ledger, XRPL, which means that the CBDC private ledger is built for payments. Can you see that everything Ripple has is made for these CBDCs? The CBDC private ledger designed for issuing 5,400 currencies, including XRP, which can be leveraged as a neutral bridge asset for frictionless value movement between CBDCs. Internet of value, guys. Ripple is literally being the internet of value. They are they created something which is a big revolution, but people are not seeing that. People are focusing on Bitcoin, which is old, slow, and, and very costly. Here we have a Ripple's XRP hits one month high on exchange relisting prospect. So this is what I've been talking about. Uh, XRP is reaching uh, 60 cents and it's uh, kind of booming. Here you can see some analysis. 
very interesting. Top trader says he's bullish on XRP and Tron. Here's why. So this is quite interesting because it's breaking down XRP in a very technical way. And you can see that XRP broke a very, very nice triangle. And this guy is believing that XRP can visit the all-time high of $3.84. And I think it's inevitable, guys. It will definitely do that. So this is another uh, pitch which the XRP gave. And you can see also here that XRP is not an investment contract. XRP is a virtual currency and thus outside the SEC's jurisdiction. Ripple has never entered a contract for an investment with any holders of XRP. Here you can see all the rules that are against the SEC. They already lost and they will never win. Crypto, crypto exchanges did not violate SEC norms by selling XRP, which is why we know now that, it, that the exchanges can safely relist XRP and they have no problem. This is the guy who broke everything down. This lawyer is amazing. He talks about uh, how XRP and uh, the SEC uh, lawsuit is going. So be sure to check him out and thank you for watching the video, guys. Have a good day.